Yo, 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 what's up everyone, it's Patrick, and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. In the last episode, I accidentally took a detour from the storyline I was working on and stumbled upon a somewhat interesting one on the Assassins. I'm now going to continue the first storyline I was working on uh, two episodes ago, which happens to be near the Assassin thing I was doing, although I ended up a bit far from where I was supposed to go so I fast traveled to a nearby viewpoint that I synchronized near the end of last episode to get a bit closer. Anyways, enjoy the video. Aid me with my eyes. I get away from me, dude. I'm just trying to go on my quest. All right, they said Susie's somewhere in this area. Where are they? That them? Oh, that is them up there. I'm not sure where that was though. It's oh, it's up there. Okay. Timing. We would have stormed the place without you. What have you seen? Soldiers aplenty, wagons going in and out. That weasel Borgred is here, I'm sure of it. The bathhouse there and that church, see? I sent a scout to check them both. Should be back at any moment now. Did you see Uba and Sigurd in Templarbrach? No. And if Borgred is hiding here, I won't have to. There is a lot we would not have to do if we stuck to killing kings. Thanks to my brother, now we are into making them. No small tension between you two. Thought you'd be more like-minded. You and Sigurd, you always see eye to eye? More often than not. You are still young. You live to my age and you will see. The closer you get, the greater the stink that rises. Time's up for your scout, I'd say. He's either dead or run off. Give him a chance. Can't risk them seeing us and Burkwood slipping away again. You stay here and wait for your scout. I'm going in. So it looks like I gotta search two locations, this church and the old bathhouse for clues. Um, looks like... Looks like this spot is closer, I'm not sure where that is. Is there a haystack for me to jump onto, or... Oh, yes there is. Assassinate him. Hey! Oh, right in the crotch. Oh, I found the way in. That was easy. Oh, I bet there's a lot of guards here. 
secure our food stores first. Oh, yes, there is. There's one with a key over here. I'm gonna take him out first. That's what all the men are saying. Tired? How do you mean? Are you blind? All right, those two got their backs turned to me, so I could probably kill this guy without them noticing. Question is, can I run up on this guy without him noticing? Uh oh. Had to do it. Ah, oh, they found me. So much for that plan. Focus, we have this. Oh wait, one of those guys had a key. Did I get the key? I hope so. Because I feel like it's needed for something. Another guy here? I don't think there's anything else here for me. Some kind of blue light over here for some reason. All of goods they've hidden away. <laughs> Trying to see if there's any way I can get up there. Oh no, the blue light's coming from down there on the table. So it looks like there's a middle level. Oh wait, there's a door right here. I'm an idiot. Here it is. Move the grain and wheat into the bathhouse. Okay, that's not, that's not a real clue. And then I believe there's another one on this side. Let's try opening this door first, though. Can I destroy the wall by any chance? Nope. I'm gonna go back out. Climb up this ladder. The door right here. Oh, this is what the key is for. Oh, that's the dude's son. Hold on. All right, let's talk to him. Have you lost your mind? I feared you were one of them. Keep quiet. What are you doing here? I'm... I was looking for Burgred. You are Ivar's scout. I hoped I might find Burgred myself and talk him into surrendering. But he's not in Leatherchester. How can you be sure? Leofrith passed this way with some men. I eavesdropped. It seems they're only stockpiling food here. But he did say something of interest. Gave orders to send the Burgred's wife, the Lady Arvilsworth. She's in Templebloch. She would know where Burgred's hiding. Do you hear that? The sounds of battle, Eva. Let's let's get you out of here now. Where are you going? I know my way around. We'll go through the market. This way. I guess we're following him. There's a guy right there. <laughs> well, we're running right in front of like enemy soldiers. Although they're not attacking us. Uh, they're everywhere. Oh, 
they just close to me. died out of nowhere. Fight, man. Fight. Moldy cheese, nice. Let's stay awake. Hey! Are you hurt? Speak up. I... I don't think so. My God. I didn't want it to come to this. They would have killed you, Gilbert. You had no choice. Now don't move. I'll be back. Face me! Where is your king, Saxon? Where is he? Lord our father, grant me salvation. When does their god find the time to answer so much mumbling and whimpering? You are reckless, Ivar. Jailbird could have been killed. Who am I to stand in the light of a boy searching for his boss? Don't excuse yourself. You enjoy this too much. Stop. It wasn't Eva who sent me. I sent myself. Have caution, boy. Until your father is crowned, you're Mercia's enemy, not its champion. You understand? I understand. Good. Now return to Repton and remain there until we call. Will you not stay, Wolfkist? There is no king, but we have corpses to loot. Burkrit's Lady Athelswith is in Templebroth. I'm going to find out what she knows. Take everything! Pile the soldiers here! Let these people bear witness to the carnage that awaits their kingdom! We're going to do this quest next. Let's see where the location... Oh, is the one where it's all the way up north. Oh boy, it's a trip. Uh, I'm gonna fast travel to my boat. This looks like a basically straight trip up the rivers. By the way, I'm not purposely steering into the land. For some reason, this boat doesn't like to turn. Demanding to meet King Sigvald, Styrbjorn's father. Nal was from Gautland. She was tall and rugged and strong, and everyone who walked near her said she smelled of men's blood. When her message was sent to our king, Nal was made to wait a full day. Yet she did not complain. She watched the waves and sang songs. Night came and went, and still Nal sat by the shore of the fjord singing her songs. She skipped rocks with children and smiled. As the afternoon... Save it for later. Best not to draw attention here. Ah, where were you? I gained a the new fast travel point, that's cool. Approached. King Sigvaldi's messenger reappeared. They spoke quite at last. The messenger stood and waved to some men nearby. Three men bearing three chests of silver approached quickly. 
They set the chests of silver in Narl's ship and stood back. Then Narl stepped forward, swinging a large, bloodied sack before her. Narl opened the sack and emptied it on the shore. Seven pairs of hands tumbled to the ground. Hush now. Were you at the good part, eh? Narl opened the sack and emptied it on the shore. Seven pairs of hands tumbled to the ground. Narl then mounted her ship and sailed away. Look! A military outpost! I can't even tell where I am right now. I'm just gonna go on foot. Man here, he'll never say anything again. Aver, there you are. What's with the prisoners? Man from the fortress, out on patrol. We squeeze them. Burger's not here. It's his queen they're guarding. Others with. They must have separated after Tomworth. I heard as much from Chelbert and Leather Chester. 
Chelbert? What was he doing there? Ivar. Too long a tale for now, but he's fine. I sent him to Repton. What's the plan here? It won't be long before someone comes looking for these men. We need to get inside and find Adel's will. Capture a queen to find a king. It might work. Only one way to find out. See if you can get anything more out of them. Me and Aver will take care of fetching Adel's with. Oh, then guide you. The Saxons won't welcome us through the front door. We could find a quiet way in. Longship. I'm beside you either way. Ah, oh, Haver. I have dreamt of this day. Of scouring the Shire in search of a king. Of going a Vikingur. With you. With our brothers and sisters. Conquering new lands. Forming lasting friendships. And if it takes chasing some weasel across a new land, so be it. I am right where I wish to be. As am I, brother. Before I continue with the quest objective, it looks like there's a book of knowledge nearby, so let's see if I could find that first. Call my raven Zuna, because me. I can never find these. So this highlight area is the quest objective, right? And it looks like the book of knowledge is within that area. Hmm. This might be a little problematic then. Should not be seen in this area. <laughs> Nothing here for you. Soldiers' barracks. Others with might be here. Oh, the book of knowledge is right here. Nice. New ability, piercing shot. That's definitely a range ability. I feel like the lady that I'm going after might be in this building. Was it really that easy? You three, scurry. Lady Avonsworth, I see Burgret has done his best to hide you away. But what is lost must always be found. Let my handmaidens walk free of this place. They have nothing to do with our quarrel. 
You hear that, Eivor? Noble. Selfless. This is the sword you must strike a bargain with. A woman of quality. We seek only your king, lady. Tell us where Burgred hides, and we will leave without an ounce of blood spilled. Please, I... I don't... I don't know. Effective, Sigurd. She is only naive to her present danger, but she will soon understand. Wait. Those are the hands of one who washes linens. A servant. She is a decoy. Very observant. Watch the handmaidens. I'll follow Athels with. Pay for your sins. We keep our wits about us. <laughs> You're like a lame mule. <laughs> oh, is she in a boat? Going anywhere. Stay away from me. Oh, what's going on? Is she drowning? My husband will send you all to hell. She's literally just under the water right now. Stop what you are doing at once. On the side. Don't you dare put your hands on me. It won't let me run any faster than this either. Put an arrow in the dog. The Lord will see us through this. around in the haze. NPCs are usually not this fast. The hell with you. Right, let's get my horse. I call horse. I knock her down with the horse. Got her. Nice. <coughs> Quite clever, your ladyship. You're certainly making us work for it. Keep your hands off me, pagan! Have you lost your sense of hospitality? <coughs> I regret asking. Let me go! I demand it! After what you put me through, I would have to be mad. Do you understand what you're doing, Pagan? I am the Lady of Mercia! You're wasting your time! I won't talk! Not to you, not to any of you barbarians! You may reconsider, if only for your people. For who knows how many more might die at the hands of us barbarians. You don't frighten me! Hey! Watch out, would you? Uh. Lady Otherswith, you have seen better days. God will sear your soul, heathen, if he can find it. Why, the cat shaver? She is as much a poet as you. Where's my Kathleen? What have you done with her? Your handmaiden, you mean? The brave one, dressed in royal finery? Season change with the others. I'll take them back to Tamworth. Get them talking. If she has so much as a scratch on her... I will inform Cheerwolf. He might have some ideas on how to get through to her. I will meet you there. 
Sigurd, what about these prisoners? We've got what we need. Let them go. Ah, what's all this? I cannot thank you enough, friend. They better not try to attack me. I'm being nice here. The guy's running away. Good enough. Looks like my next objective is all the way down here. So, before I leave, I kind of want to have go after uh, this thing. What do you guys think? Is this inside or is it in some underground entrance like the other ones usually? The other side must be barred. No, I think this is inside. That guy didn't see me, really? Assuming I just go under there, and the only way I could do that is if I knock one of these down. Here it is, this should be it. This big chest right here. Huntsman Cloak. Point as a fast travel. Your turn. She won't talk to me. Hey. Oh, do I get to interrogate her? You have exhausted my friend Uber here, but I'm wide awake. Maybe tell me where Burkrit is hiding and let him rest happy. Never. Stone-faced and tight-lipped, all for a king who hides like a cowardly vole, too scared to protect his family and his people. Thirsty? My husband does what he must for Mercia. How could he do otherwise, knowing that even his closest friends could betray him? 
Give that traitor Cheowulf my message. He may win this earthly battle, but the devil has won the war for his soul. Cheowulf is a Mercian doing his best to find common footing in this new land. Seems to be the only true Mercian by my reckoning. I spit on him. Whatever life he makes in Mercia will be built on the graves of the nobles who gave their lives to defend it. The longer you drag this out, the truer that becomes. We've taken Repton, Tamworth, now Tamblebroth, and Lederchester. With each victory, your hope for peace recedes. Yet Borgred has what you do not. The loyalty of his people. Good men. Faithful men. Who? The Thanes and Chills of Mercia? No, no. Only Leofrith remains loyal, and he too will fall. Yes, goodly Leofrith. He will die defending his king. And win or lose, he will send a hundred more of you to hell. Eivor, your ladyship, do not mind me. Only here to count my spoils. Oh, God! Pigs have to eat, my lady. The trouble is, it takes a lot to sate their hunger. Only a matter of time before they finish those and sniff around for fresher meat. And the smell of pig shit after this? Ooh. My... my god! Get me out of here! Please! Talk now, and we'll draw you a nice warm bath. You... You are asking me to betray my husband. How can I do that? If you don't, you will betray countless others. In legend, you may be remembered as the king and queen who abandoned their kingdom in its darkest hour. But there will be peace. This is Chaelwolf's promise, and it will be honored. You have my word. Does the caged bird sing? Burkrit is hiding, in an old crypt to the south, where the Alney and Arrow rivers join. A crypt? Now tell me this is not a sign from the gods. It's a long way to carry a king. The three of you must clear a path back to Tamworth. Where can we meet? Bring him to the bridge at Venonus. It's a straight line through. We'll deal with any trouble there. The heads were a nice touch. I'm not one for spectacle, but it got her talking. Spectacle? That's just me. Whoever trains these Mercian soldiers should be relieved of their duty, I think. That guy is really one sick bastard, let me tell you. Oh man, where am I supposed to go now? Alright, looks like this is my closest fast travel. Continue. Let me see if I can figure out where this thing is. You know what I just thought of? What if I could shoot the bar door from over here? That's the only thing I can think of, but it's not... I can't draw a weapon. Unless I stand on that platform, maybe. I guess I'd give it a try.
idea. Wait, what does this say? Block up the damn windows in the rear. Any passing nonce can see inside our gear, our goods, and the weak bloody timber we have blocking the door. The problem is I can't see in there. I don't know how I'm going to do this. That did not work. Oh, I think it's on fire. Oh, my arrows are on fire. Oh, there's light in there now. Where did that come from? Oh, wait, I could see. I think that's it. Did I get it? Oh, I think I got it. Let me get some arrows back. Probably in for a fight as soon as I step in there. Try to close the door on me. All that for a new shield, which I don't even use shields. Now I can continue with the quest. That's a cool view. <laughs> Locate area. Have a look, Sudan. Horse. Looks like this might be a restricted area coming up. Find and explore the king's hideout. The old crypt is in the south. not coming over here. Is that trouble? Could be tucked up in the fogger. I hope the other guy over there doesn't turn towards me or hears this. Better keep a look out. <laughs> <laughs> nice, I didn't know these two guys were over here. Remain dead. 
There's a key somewhere over there. More guards right here. If I take out this guy, the guy next to him is gonna hear me. So let's try this. I'm hiding haystack. And then we're gonna do the whistle. What's that about? As I suspected, the closer guy heard me, but not the one who's further away. So I think I could take this guy out without being noticed. Well, I won't nod off. Definitely something below me, too. It looks like the key might also be below me. Got it. Stairs that lead straight to the basement. It's got to be down here. Where are you hiding, Bergret? See that a uh, little crevice that I can crawl through, but I just want to explore this area real quick before I go in there. Hmm, there's also this crevice. Damn, this place is a whole maze. Assassinate one and we're gonna have to fight the other one head on. And there's another crevice here. What? Oh, I didn't mean to do it. I still want to loot these guys. Looks like just food in here. This leads back to the surface. K 
came from this way, so... And I think I came that way originally, so let's go down this way. I must be getting close. Assuming I can destroy this wall by hitting that oil jar. Let me explore some more. Oh, whoa. There's a guy in here. The Lord! Intruders! Gotta feed the worms! I think I just got the key from that guy. I don't think there's anything else in this room. He's probably down that way, but before I go down there, I want to explore that uh, crevice towards the beginning. Hopefully that's the last thing. I right, just got to move this out of the way. Both, both options were the triangle button, and apparently I just pressed it for the wrong thing. Focus of the Nornir? I don't know what that means. It's a range ability, apparently. Use the power to aim and shoot at your enemies with faithful speed. I don't know how helpful it's gonna be, but not like I have anything else to assign there. that that's a bread knife my lord do you mean to butter me stay back back I say I'll fight you if you insist you'll have to kill me luckily for you the won't come to is mine this kingdom is mine mine am I fighting him without a weapon First off, I'm gonna tie him up first before I do anything. Time to go, my lord. We're late for the crowning ceremony. I'm gonna leave him right there for a moment while I loot everything. Did I get something from that, or? Oh, I got an axe. That means this other armor piece is probably what's behind that wall. If I shoot that. I 
I gotta dive down. back to the king and hopefully he's still tied up. Tied him up already. I don't know if I could just walk out with him because I'm pretty sure there's guards outside. No guards, I guess. There's two by the entrance. I'm gonna have to stash this guy somewhere. Put him down right here. I'm gonna assassinate the one with the shield. It's gonna be a little harder to get rid of. Think you've won? You haven't, Lyofris. I, I sent him away with orders to destroy you. Like what? I had the mess you're in. You don't know the half of it. Ah! Get me off this thing! Well, that's a lot of soldiers. to go fast right behind you wait I gotta go somewhere else Back up. Are they even behind me? I'm not talking about the bad guys, I mean my friends who are supposed to be helping me out.
are. Look familiar? No! Change has come, Burgred. All that remains is a coronation. A witten with the Lords of Mercia. Burgred, my love! My lady, are you injured? Did they hurt you? No, no. I'm fine. Move along, Lord. Your king awaits. Your death will come, Danes. Your end was writ the moment you came for me. I have made damn sure of that. The Zealots will know your name soon enough. No matter where you are or how far you travel, they will hunt you down. Enough of that, you squeaking sparrow. <laughs> Let my brother be the lunatic of Tamworth. Zealots? What does he mean? Ignore him. Desperate pleas and prophecies. Nothing more. Walk with me, Wolfkist. We have some time before the ceremony. Where to? Nowhere in particular. I only want to celebrate. Didn't think you were the type. You have drawn a dark conclusion about me, haven't you? It is all well and good. I've drawn some about you as well. Are you leading a lamb to slaughter? See what I mean. Dark. Too dark. You there! Get lost! <laughs> Sit down. I know I have been a cock, but you are a good fighter. I respect that. Let it be said that Ivar the Boneless considers Eivor a friend. Who calls you Boneless? Some backrout I killed in Hibernia. Used his guts to shine my spear. Called me Boneless because I move like a reed in the wind. Not because you're always too drunk to plow? Valhalla. That is where I am bound. I can smell the blood and taste the mead. I will sit beside the High One with my axe in hand. A fitting end for Arachnison. You would think, eh? Me, Hafton, we will be there. But Uba... No. I do not think we are chasing the same victory. Not anymore. What does Uba want? To grow old and fat on the farm somewhere to chase about. He wants an heir. It's a common dream. Not for a warrior. Not for Drengir like us. He was different before. But this place, England, it softened him. What was he like before? Like me. Ferocious. Wild. With respect, I don't think anyone is like you. If that is a compliment, I missed it. All I mean to say is... Things were easier some time ago. If it bothers you so much, why not strike out on your own? Because he is my brother. I love him. And I will do what it takes to drag him back around to my way of thinking. We are warriors, all. And that is to the death. Oh! <laughs> 
Where is my son? We sent word to Repton, but we've had no word, Lord. I suggest we carry on. You sought me out, old friend. And here I am, standing before the throne from which I reigned not long ago. You stand before us to accept this Witten's unanimous decision. That you are unfit to rule, and are hereby deposed. We demand the abdication of your kingdom and your crown to Thane Chairwolf. Mercia has spoken, Lord. The crown. Is that you, old friend? Ah, yes, I see it now. <laughs> Forgive me. The robes of righteousness sit so loosely upon your shoulders. If the heavens mismark me as king, forgive its obscuring light. Amen. Now, where is my crown? Forgive my nerves. Here I am, an upright man who never once learned how to bend the knee. And yet, I shall try. Ah, how simple it is. How easy to kneel without fear and feeling. He's mocking you, man. I'd kill the fucker. Worry not, Dane. I shall resign this crown and this pagan-infested kingdom, and the favors of these two-faced men. But I will do so on my terms. My demands are simple. Firstly, you must... Uh... You fool. Look around you. You have no leverage here. Plead for your life, for it is the only thing these men will grant you. Yes, yes. Forgive me, I, I do not harm me. I beg of you, please. I'll go anywhere. Here, I, 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 I resign it. Here. Take this lord and his wife to Rome. He is hereby exiled, never to return. The Witten recognizes King Chairwolf of Mercia, second of his name, a just king, a merciful king. God save the king! You better be worth all this trouble. Mercian soldiers marching on Repton! Leofrid. Loyal to the ugly and the bastard. Gather what men you have and split them between the north and south gates. I should divide his forces. Cheobert is there. Evo, you must save my son. He will come through this, I promise. I will stay here with Cheobert. Go. During that cutscene, while the guy was doing all that rambling, I really expected him to, like, 
you know, try to attack the king or something, because I don't know if you guys noticed, but he had a little knife at his side. Which, by the way, why would they even let him in with that? Or more importantly, why would they even let him uh, that close to the king with that? Travel to Repton. There's a fast travel thing there. They have breached the walls. I must find Jailbird. Tailbent. It is the only prize worth taking to this Matzik. We gotta find the sun. My thanks! Your mistake. Please, you do not want to do this. Leofred, let him walk. You answer to me. I answer to my king. Our silence deeds with this. Lay it by, Leofred. There's nothing left to fight for. We have stormed Repton. Only a matter of time. I cannot do that. Then, you will die. Someone will. You can't win this, Leofrid. Even if you defeat me, the Rachnesons have won the day. I have fought many a day in my time. I am still standing. Yeah, I'm out of arrows. Oh, what is that? I do not want to get hit by that. Let me try one of these new weapons I just got. Or, well, I got a little bit ago when I kidnapped the king, because... Yeah, that's why I want a spear. Because this guy keeps ducking me, and I feel like I'd do better if I can hit um, from a farther range. Just 
slowing. Bah! You are strong-willed pain. Urfrid was lucky. To stand in the way of you and Mercia is my duty. I will die before I yield. You cannot win. I'm about to win. Come on, one more good hit. to your god or your king i swore an oath to serve borgrid to the death i fought i lost we both know how this goes an honorable thane fighting a dishonorable war borgrid abandoned him betrayed his trust if i were leofrid i would want to know why rob him of this last glory a warrior ready to meet his god and bask in his praise. To live will only lead him to shame. It's not an oath he would keep if he knew the truth. Then choose. Truth or glory. Stand, Leovrid. Live to fight another day. What? Your loyalty to Burkrit is not a loyalty returned. He resigned the crown and fled to Rome. He's gone. You lie. Lie to a man seconds from death? What would I gain? He saved himself and left you to die. All this fighting, it's for nothing. For no one. To betray one so trusted. So close. It's a dishonor worth a thousand deaths. Eivor, you have shown me a great kindness. It, it is only fitting that I do the same. At Venonis, there is a statue with a scroll laid in a small bowl. You must burn it. A scroll? Your name is on this scroll. At Burgred's request, I put it there. When it is found, the zealots who read it will hunt you. Who are they? It doesn't matter now, you haven't much time. Burn the scroll, or they will never stop hunting you. And where will you go now? Rome. Come on, let's take you back. Careful, you're injured. I'm all right, really. A few nicks and cuts from the battle, that's all. These wounds will heal quickly. You're lucky. I threw myself at him, Eivor. But he only toyed with me. He knew I couldn't touch him. You should have stayed hit. Jailbird, this wasn't your fight. It was. It was our fight. Yours, mine, my father's. I had to help. And you did. You showed courage today. Bravery. You are a boy no longer.
back there with Leofred. I didn't think you'd spare him. There's no honor in killing a man misled. He believed his king would die fighting for Mercia. He knows the truth now. And with that truth, he forges a new path. You were right about him, Chilbert. I'm right to believe the line that divides us can be thinner than it seems. Now what would happen if I killed him because I would have never found out about that. They basically put a hit out on Eivor over here. Jailbert! Look at you! Bloody and battle-worn. Could be chieftain of your own clan with courage like that. No less than the King of Mercia, brother. One of these days. And how is my father taking to his new role? See for yourself. You're an Otlinger now. Or Athling, I think you'd say. Next in line for the throne. It's an honorable title. One that demands good judgment. Be careful who you trust. My son. Are you well? Yes, father. Well enough. He honored you today. Fought bravely against many stalwart foes. You have my thanks. All of you. And my blessing. We knew what this alliance might cost us. But it's over now. And everyone has gained something. Silver. Honor. Allies. Agreed. Today we turn a new page. All of England must know. The Kingdom of Mercia has a new king. The remaining kingdoms of England won't respect your path to power. Nor will many in my kingdom. Burgred's soldiers will stand tall in the face of this turmoil, all across Mercia, against us. That we shall remedy soon enough. I am riding for Oxenifordshire directly, to forge an alliance with some thanes there. Shall I go with you? Not till I know more. Linger here a while if you can. Strengthen our friendships. I will send for you soon enough. Sigurd, I would feel better if Chaelbert was away from here until Mercia is more stable. Would you welcome him among your clan? Hmm. Do you have a horse, young Adeling? I do. A young steed called Theobald. Good. I can ride with you as far as the river Nene. You may find your way from there. Thank you, Sigurd. This puts my mind at ease. Be ready for my call, Eivor. It will come. You and Sigurd make a good pair. The future of England will be pagan from top to bottom. Take this, Wolfkist, as a sign of friendship. And should you call, the brothers Ragnarsson will come. You honor me, Uba. See that? Sly bastard trying to win your heart. Well, two can play at that game. How kind of you, Ivar. My pleasure. Our friendship is the best thing to come from this mess. Maybe Chelbert too, the brave little twig. That is good to hear.